queridos idiomixes, ¿cómo están? Bienvenidos a la octava emisión de este su noticiero Idiomixes News. El único noticiero en el cual podrán aprender inglés de manera fácil y sobre todo divertida, liderado por unas gemelas. Bien, el día de hoy, ¿qué vamos a aprender? Mel preparó un tema muy interesante y por cierto es una experta entonces ¿qué les parece si sí, vamos a ver qué fue lo que preparó para nosotros? Adelante Mel, te escuchamos, vamos contigo. Oh, oh, <laughs> oh, you are here. Hello, hello, dear mixes, how are you doing? Uh, I am Mel and I am very excited to see you again. Uh, today we are going to talk about uh, clothes, but we are going to use some Taylor Swift's outfits because she's iconic and I love her and she's my favorite artist and actually who doesn't love her? So we are going to start. Are you ready to start? Let's go. To talk about what we are wearing, we use this structure. Subject plus verb to be plus the verb wearing, which means usar en términos de ropa. Okay, so now we are seeing uh, this picture. Uh, she's wearing a shirt, a tank top, a pair of jeans, and a pair of tennis shoes. In this picture, we see that she's wearing a dress, she also wears a purse, and she's wearing a, a pair of flats. In this picture, we see that she is wearing cap, a pair of sunglasses, a t-shirt, some sports shorts, she's also wearing socks, and a pair of tennis shoes. In this picture, she's wearing a hat, a cardigan, a blouse, a pair of shorts, a handbag, and a pair of boots. In this picture, she's wearing a scarf, a coat, and some pants. In this other picture, she's wearing a sweater, a skirt, and a pair of high heels. In the next one, she's using an umbrella, a jacket, tights, and a pair of ankle boots. So what is the importance of learning uh, this vocabulary, these vocabulary clothes? Well, this is very important because it is a part of our daily life, of course, and also because if we travel to another country and we need to buy some clothes, um, it is really important to know um, to know the name of this of these clothes. Entonces, ¿por qué es muy importante que aprendamos este vocabulario de la ropa? Porque obviamente es parte de nuestra vida diaria, lo usamos todos los días y también cuando viajemos y necesitemos comprar alguna ropa. Um, algún vestido, un sombrero, si hace frío, un chaleco, un saco, eh, obviamente necesitaremos saber cómo pedirlo. So, I think that's already for today. We will back in the studio with you, Mel. See you. Gracias, Mel. Este creo que ha sido uno de mis programas favoritos. Sin duda, eres la mejor. Por cierto, no puedo creer lo mucho que hemos avanzado. Y como les dije al principio, ya estamos en la octava emisión. Estoy muy orgullosa de ustedes. Muchas gracias por seguir sintonizándonos. No se pierdan del siguiente capítulo de Idiomixes News. 
Hasta la próxima.